Good morning, everyone. It is day two of moving house. I've just been like running errands this morning, going to the post office, doing like just like, I don't know, getting rid of stuff that I needed to get rid of in my room. I've still got so much to do. It's absolutely crazy. So much more is happening with the house today. I'm going to show you a lot more of the house. I've actually just, yeah, been out busy all morning. But when I woke up this morning and I was in my bed at my parents' house, I remember just, I sat there for a minute and I was just like, oh my goodness, this is the last time I'm going to, I'm going to be here. Like that's absolutely absolutely nuts obviously not like ever but it's probably the last time i'll stay in the house i mean my parents won't keep that room in case i come back because i've just built a house so they will definitely get rid of that room i don't even think it's going to be a guest room so it probably will be the last time i'll ever stay there which is really 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 weird but at the same time i'm so excited i just about to go and pick mum up and we're gonna go head to the house and yeah bring on another day of moving So I've just turned up at the house. It's all going on. There's so many people here on a Saturday morning uh, and mum and I were a bit like lost. We don't really know what to do because we don't want to get people's way. But I think we're going to just carry on unpacking upstairs. What I didn't tell you in the last vlog is I have actually got somebody to organise my wardrobe now. A girl called Carla, which I'm so excited for her to come in a couple of days. So I've unpacked most of my clothes, but I just need to pretty much get them in the wardrobe so I can get the boxes and stuff out. And then she's going to come in and kind of like organise it for me because I'm not very good at that stuff. Like I don't even find it satisfying. It's just for me, it honestly like frazzled my brain trying to like kind of coordinate stuff and organize stuff. So she's going to come in and do that for me. But all of my products and stuff, I'm just going to do myself and I do have a lot of them. So it's going to take mum and I a while. This morning though, I did start putting like some products in the bathroom and stuff and it just looks like so nice and clean. I don't know how long I can keep it like this for, but I'm going to absolutely try and keep it up. And I'm going to show you my um, kitchen cupboard as well because I went a bit um, OTT on on the mugs guys can't lie in fact not even just the mugs everything so my um all of my what do you call this mum tableware not tableware what is it all of my dinnerware i went a bit ott on just because i <laughs> basically i got these ages ago ages and ages ago they're from um soho home and i love them so much and i was just so scared that they was going to discontinue so i got a stupid amount of them just in case and i just absolutely love them so much there's one glass gone because i've just literally made myself a drink but how nice are the glasses as well these are all from oliver bonus and then my favorite vodka brand ever belvedere look how nice these are jed actually got me these for one of my birthdays i absolutely love them so yeah this i find quite satisfying because it's all just very neat but i do need to get some wine glasses that is a must, because currently I have two. As you all know, I'm literally bulk obsessed. So I literally have ordered, you can't even see how big this box is. The biggest box in my house, ready for when I move in. These are literally like my favorite protein bars of all time. But I do think it's like a love or a hate these. It's a bit like Marmite. I absolutely love them, so do my friends. It's like they're Marmite, Marmite, sorry. But I think they are absolutely unbelievable. And then I just got like more bottles, my favorite protein powders. This is actually a new flavor of the clear way isolate. So I wanted to try it out. Oh, mum, look, this is the new packaging for the peanut butter. It actually is a lot nicer, isn't it? Yeah, it's got I prefer the packaging, butter. yeah. It's really nice. But when I was buying it, I was like, wait, is this the same peanut butter? Because all I wanted to say is peanut butter, but yes, it is. Oh, no, 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 I got one for you as well. Oh, thank you. So I thought I'm not going to be there for you now. So I want to go about peanut butter. <laughs> but I am sucking up because it is my favorite. There's something just about like unpacking everything that just brings me so much joy. Aside from the clothes, because the clothes are stressful, but the kitchen that I actually do enjoy. All my protein powders are out. This is gonna have to be the alcohol spare cup. Well, actually, that's a lie. I actually will have the second fridge that. Oh, wait, is the fridge come? The fridge was meant to come today. I'm gonna have a second fridge in here that's basically to be like mixers, alcohol stuff will go in here. Then obviously my main fridge will have all my food and everything else because, you know, I hope to throw lots of parties so there'll be one integrated in here eventually that I can move the alcohol over. Also, I had nowhere to put this. I love it so much though. My mum and dad got it for me for Christmas a couple of years ago and I kept it, obviously, because I've been moving for that long. But it actually does look quite nice here inside of the utility room. So let me know what you think, but there's not any room in the stairs. And it, oh, it just kind of looks a bit weird on the stairs. So I'm thinking here, but if anyone has any other ideas, please do let me know. Somebody said to me, mum, on Instagram, they said, we need to wait, we need to know what all your crockery is ASAP. So that's what it's called, crockery. Crockery? crockery. My mugs and stuff. 
Yeah. Is that what mugs and plates are? Crockery is knives and forks. Yeah. Oh, yeah. knife and forks. Yeah. Oh, right, so that's not it then. Yeah. So is it just dinnerware yeah, then dinnerware, for mugs yeah. and... Oh. Dinnerware for my glasses and um, plates and stuff like that. It's the whole dinnerware thing. And then the crockery is just the knife and forks. Oh. We are in the car and we're going to do... Ah, the, the big shop. The <laughs> bit. The, the big shop. shop. The big oh, the shop. shop. We are on our way to Tesco. Yes, we are. And my goodness, oh boy, it's a bit bouncy. This is gonna be a big old shop. And also, just going back to the conversation before, I've just got in the car and what's that word again that you said about the plates and actually went crockery? And I was like, no, no, that is plates and stuff. Yeah, that is it. I don't know why. <laughs> Wait, you know my mum and my mum older were like, no, that's we definitely crockery. We were like analyzing for ages. You know, like, I know it's crockery, of course I know that, but you know when someone says a word and it's just the word and it sounds really weird, you know when people just- It sounds like cutlery, like, so I get no, it. No, I know exactly, but it is it's cutlery though. Cutlery and crockery. But it's just because I never really thought about the word. When you say crockery, on its own it's just such a weird word that make me doubt myself and I'm thinking I don't know what it is but of course I know what it is yeah anyway you didn't so know we what are not but well, I do I'd, if you, you said didn't. to me if you said can you get the crockery out I'd be like oh yeah and I'd go and get the plates now I'd know what crockery is because you went what does crockery mean and I start questioning myself anyway Tesco here we come <laughs> and I tell you I have been looking forward to this for so long I am so excited to do the food shop I think anybody that's like just moved out or has their own place can understand the excitement of a food shop and obviously I have absolutely nothing so there's a lot to get so yeah I'm gonna, gonna do the food shop mum and I obviously stay in there tonight the only thing is we don't actually have the oven yet so the oven arrives on Monday as I'm filming this it's Saturday so we can't actually cook like hot food yet which is annoying and it's annoying because my hello fresh stuff which I love has just arrived um so i'm really hoping it doesn't go out of date by the time that my oven comes so we're probably just gonna go to like a pub or something and get dinner tonight i don't know we might we might make something but anyways we don't have an oven so actually saying that my little microwave is actually an oven as well so maybe we could but either way we need to get food for the next couple of days so that is the plan and things like washing up liquid and stuff why does that excite me I don't know, but just remember, buying, you're buying the washing for stuff person, i know and everything goes out day in a couple of days no this is what so i learned this is what down. i learned from living um, by myself last time is so that was a year ago, so yeah that was a year ago no but I hate food. wasting food it's the worst thing ever and I do have my hello fresh stuff at home as well yeah, exactly. so but I feel I feel like it's more like the washing it's stuff like, I need I like to tin get foil and toilet yeah and, and like scissors and stuff like that yeah. I don't even have oh my goodness right I knew they did the um peri peri sauces but I didn't know they did the peri peri salt I'm actually although it's a little bit spicy for me I'm actually starting to love this but petition for Nando's to actually bring out their peri tamer so I swear I'd be their best-selling sauce. I don't know why they don't sell it separately. I am doing my shop and mum's right in front. Literally, we keep crossing aisles, don't we? <laughs> well, I'm like, have you got these? One in yours, one in mine. <laughs> Honestly, it's getting very full very quickly. I think I'm on like aisle three. But it's just like all the essentials that I do need. Like these oats will blast me. I don't even know how long because look how big the bag is. Honestly, I always find cheaper the oats the nicer they are. But when there is this one brand that's unreal, but I can't remember what it's called now. But I actually got scent, and it wasn't it wasn't the oats so simple. It wasn't these, even though these are good. There's another brand. It's unreal. If I ever think of it, I'll let you know. I'm sure, people probably don't care, but I do love oats. So, oh my goodness, are these not the best crisps ever? If you haven't tried them, or if you don't know, get to know because these are unreal. In fact, I love all the proper chips, but these are the best ones, the barbecue ones. My goodness, and then the proper corn, popcorn. I didn't know they actually did the salted caramel now. Movie night for mum and I tonight. Could get these. Oh my God, so excited to try salted caramel. She's in her favourite aisle in the world. We just stopped going on about getting washing powder I'm and washing so up excited. stuff. I'm so excited. No, because when I lived in my house, didn't I like have an obsession with like You're washing, washing my oh, clothes? Oh, I smell really good to Smell amazing. It smells so much. Mum, um, washing my clothes. You're right, babe. stuff in my trolley oh, now. Do you want to pay for it? No, <laughs> thank you. But thank Mine's you for getting... always smells so good. And, and do you also, know what? I'm great at washing whites, just to let everyone know. And this it's also I thought old. very patterned plus yeah. they are the best These dishwasher oh, yeah, yeah, they're just really so good, good. like we really i've good. worked with i don't know if you've worked with them before but honestly that they got me really into good. them and they are oh, the I love smell. oh my god i love the dental wipes i actually do these are just so quite useful bad for the environment, but huh they're quite bad for the environment but you know oh well if i just keep them <laughs> yeah keep but this will last a long yeah. time keep them these are really good anyways i'm so washing excited powder. i feel like i should just give a massive haul when i'm home yeah what washing powder are you going to choose we're well, dying know. to know well the one that sounds the nicest everyone's on mom offer. to be fair you, nobody <laughs> ever asked my mom what she's using because currently our washing's not smelling nice <laughs> it does like it doesn't it just doesn't i don't it know it does if it's now i think it's my washing but it does I now i don't know mom and the thing is as well 
mum says everything that's white, grey. So I literally hated my mum washing my clothes. So. Oh well, you haven't got to worry about it anymore. I have you? haven't, no. Love this. With all my life, straight in the basket. To confirm it has been a successful shopping trip. One of these are actually my mum's. I'm going to give it a big call once I'm home because there is a lot of stuff, but I think I might have just remembered everything. I mean, I'm sure I've definitely forgot something. There she goes. I'm the worst person ever at packing up bags. Did a She's terrible just got job. so stressed out about not being quick enough. I'm like, why are you worried? Oh, what do you I think that know. cashier's I gonna go? Know. Hurry up, lady. I've developed this new thing where I just honestly worry about the most stupid things. She's like, can you and come and help me? I'm like, no, I'm too home. <laughs> and also as well, I haven't got any of the actual like recyclable bags. I need to buy some, but there wasn't any to well, You've got like a thousand. No, they're in a different place now. I bought one, right? Yeah, but it's tiny. No, they're, that's what they're like now. I was like, this can't oh, no. be the reusable bag. Mouse on. <laughs> I was like, you really did. Serious? Yeah, I did put the Minnie Mouse one. <laughs> I was like, you're being serious. That's how small they are. Yours are big. I need to get some of those big ones. The shop was successful. Oh, also, I'm oh, sorry. I'm <laughs> just poking your mum with the stems of the flowers over here. Also, just, oh my goodness, I literally can't vlog. Also, just went to the florist, got my first flowers for at home from to me, from me. Um, and then my mum also got some flowers as well, actually, for my nan's birthday. My nan's birthday tomorrow. So, yeah. Just bought some pretty flowers. Although, one thing we did learn today is, so peonies, I think, are one of my favorite flowers. What's those other ones that I absolutely love? What was that one that she said? You know, the pinky one, I love those. They do it in like blue and stuff as well, don't they? The one that I asked about that was in the other set of flowers. Peony. That was on a peony. Peony are out of season. Ooh. Yeah, I just learned peony that. Peony I just learned new. that. Anyways, my favorite flower, I can't remember what it's called. I'll leave it on screen if I can ever think of it, but I probably won't be able to, because. I forget it every time. She did tell me and I went, oh, I ask every time and I forget every time. Yeah, I wanted to get some of them, but basically they were very low stock. So mainly got lilies, but they look gorgeous. And I'm not sure what these are called, but they look pretty too. Mum is chauffeur as usual. Back to my house. Yes. Here we go. Cool. <laughs> okay, so flowers are going in my only vase I have. So I have like a million vases, but none of them like you can like, actually put flowers, flowers in. <laughs> no, just like ornament vases. Oh my god, there's still like water everywhere. I accidentally oh, just put my mum's flowers on the side and I've now spilled water everywhere. So that is just not, not fun. Really no, these are not the best tea towels, they just look nice. Why are like nice things not practical? That is the problem that we're having. Anyways, I'm gonna give you a little um Oh, I can't see me, but <laughs> hi, mom. <laughs> Gonna give you guys a little haul. Yeah. My check, my check, yeah, check, my check. Yeah, 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 yeah. Right, here we go. Let's rip this off the fridge. I've been waiting to do this for so long. Don't eat. Oh my god. I'm not doing a very good job of it, am I? Too much. Can't do shit, can't make it up. Can't do shit, can't make it up. Work up a job, can't make enough. There is just something satisfying about an empty, clean fridge. This, in approximately about five minutes, is going to be completely full. Let's fill this fridge up. Let's go. With me, soul still full, but I'm feeling empty. Checking my phone, seeing what they sent me. I'm all out too, but I'm home mentally. I need something else. It's the early 20s. Yeah. The question is, do you think ketchup goes in the fridge? I say no. I say no. All my friends say yes. This is it. I always thought I don't get it. Her. I don't get it. The warehouse, it was feeling like Best Buy. Being dub was the best ride. Had a few shows. These really cute little pepper pots, right? So I'm going to fill them up. And obviously, I'm holding it upside down to put it in the hole, but it's all just coming out the other side. And so I've now got salt everywhere. I know you probably can't see because it's a white table. But I'm like, how am I meant to fill this up? Do I just have to hold? Like, this one's fine because I can hold my finger there. But like, what do I do with this one? I don't know what to do with it. And I don't know if I'm just being really stupid. I mean, maybe I can hold it like that, but I didn't even think about it so it's just gone everywhere even like that i'm scared it's all just gonna come out anyways on another note how cute are they they're so nice just obviously not very practical but these are from h&m home but i did actually get these a while ago can't lie so i don't know they will still have them yeah okay when i wasn't being stupid um i did literally just put my finger over them and managed to fill them up and they look so cute i'm literally just gonna leave them here on my side next to this olive oil and vinegar because I just think it looks really nice. Look how cute, love it. I just can't believe this. I don't even have a dustpan and brush. That's one thing I forgot to buy. And I'm just, I'm so like just dirty right now. I don't, well, I do know how it's, it's the moving of the house and also the fact I just, I just spilt the salt and the pepper. <laughs> So 
situation is I'm sat in my dressing room, I've got my slippers on and I'm going through all my products. I'm trying to find a place to put them all. Believe it or not, although I have, you know, a very big house with lots of storage, I still feel like I have nowhere to put anything. So that's good. I definitely do. I just don't know. I just don't know where to start, you know. But I'm trying to just do all my makeup products anyways. Back to the shop I go. I have spent the last, I don't even know how many hours, just like sorting out products into cabinets and like getting rid of things I'm not going to use, things that have multiple of things that I can give away. I literally have spent hours doing it, I'm not kidding. It's actually made me really tired, just like mentally, I don't know. To be fair, I've done so many steps, walking up and down the steps today. I wish I had my Apple Watch on and yesterday because I don't think I've ever done so many steps in a day just from walking up and down the stairs a million times. But I'm back at the shop. Um, my mum's actually still at my house, bless her. She's just like organizing stuff for me. I've come back because I didn't even get cleaning products. I forgot cleaning products. To be fair, I couldn't have fit anything else in the trolley anyway. So I need to get cleaning products and I need to get a dustpan and brush that's what I need to get it was a success people lovely so I've come home and mum has cleaned up thank you very much mum I've got all my new cleaning products I did forget yeah it's looking it's looking so clean I haven't actually showed you the double-sided fireplace obviously you're gonna see everything once the house once I do the house tour but how cool is it that there's a TV either side because obviously there will be chairs and stuff here it's very 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 soon and but for now we only have the sofa but the sofa oh I've said it so many times so much I love the sofa and I'll keep saying how much I love the sofa because I am just obsessed aren't I mum yes you are so am I <laughs> I don't want a whole house. I just, my favorite part of this whole house is standing here and, and seeing looking the stairs. at the staircase. That staircase, like if you just had a normal staircase, this house would not look half. I mean, obviously <laughs> it's still amazing, but it just, the staircase just does it. <laughs> Thanks. Just, I just love it. Oh my goodness, look how cute, guys. So my mum got me this as a moving in present and I absolutely love this doormat, but I can't even have it, which is so sad because my door is too thick that it like... It's too low. Well, it's too low, yeah. Oh, I'm actually so upset. Oh, this is sad. Huh? Who remembers the mat the first time round? Oh, Saffron's home. Here that long. <laughs> That's right. Where is that? I don't know. It is here. No, it is here. <laughs> Definitely tanked it, didn't we? Like, yeah. just have a bath or something. Yeah. Where are we going, Mum? Oh, we're off to see the local pubs. <laughs> oh, go and check them out on Saturday night. Let's go. Mum is sleepover. Did you say that? You I haven't that actually said that yet. Mum is sleeping over for the first night. I have had just. Had I just might have said it. I've had a shower, but I still look the same because. I was about to I say, mean, how, how was the shower, by the way? The shower was really nice, but it stressed me out because as soon as I stepped in, my feet were so dirty, the white sort of floor went black, and I had to walk across to get the shower gel. Mom, and I had black foot Mom, I was about to say, where did the black footprints come from? But then I from? had to get. Yeah, they're still the other there. shower to wash it all away. They're still and there. I was washing it with my hands because there's no cloth in there. And they're still there. Right? That's yes. welcome to your own world, then. It's going to be worse for you. <laughs> Great. Let's go. Update everybody. Just my dad's arrived. Here he is. The man himself. I'm not shouting because the pub's absolutely full. That's why I'm, that's why I'm not shouting. This is relaxing. Thank you, Mum. Hello, I wear the pub. Well, at least they can understand me. You talk a million miles an hour, so don't know which one's worse. She does talk a million miles an hour. I watched myself back on camera and I think, I can't even understand what I'm saying. How the hell, I'm trying to speak slowly now, how the hell can anyone understand me? Like, literally, I speak a million miles an hour. I literally talk like this all the time. And it's very fast. <laughs> Sorry. Anyways, no, start thanks, out. Darren. What are you doing? No, we don't want that. We've got. That. We're sharing this. What would be nice if you didn't put your food on our plate? Anyways, Dad got squid for starter, and we got some raft. What do we want? We want some sardines. We wouldn't let him go. <laughs> no, we wouldn't. Don't want him eating sardines next week. I don't like the smell. <laughs> That looks incredible. Oh my goodness. Yeah, mum wasn't going to have any, but now, thank goodness for the extra spoon. <laughs> my dad's going to do the fire. I'm actually very scared because my dad and fires are not good. It's not cold, no. The gas is in there, yeah, so. I think that's it. I think Whatever it looks like. Ooh, I'm scared. Hold my hand, mum. I'm scared because last time, dad nearly set the whole house on fire. Yeah, when we was in our old house. Because that's when it's been a fool. Being a fool. We need to wait for fireman to get here. <laughs> Woo! Go. Woo! Is God, that actually right? scared me. Well, why is it? Oh, it's just done now. Yeah. Oh. So is big or is it Aww. Cute. Love that. Oh, that's a big old pop when it comes on. Yeah, honestly, that that's absolutely terrified me. Funny. And also, you've got to try and shut that now. Turn it off. I think there must be a stick or something. 
something to do it with. Oh, that looks so nice. Love it. Oh, and then we just have a magic Christmas tree. Oh, I know. I can't wait. Where are you going to put your Christmas tree? By the big window upstairs. Oh, yeah. So you're not having anything down here? I might get a second. <laughs> Guys, I just had my first shower and I'm about to put my dirty washing down the laundry chute. Here we go. <laughs> Love that. Shame nobody's gonna wash it for me, but it's just down there now. I don't even need to take it downstairs. Love you. So happy to say my first night. Sleep. Oh, I didn't tell everyone about my bed. It's only like 10 o'clock, we're gonna bed so excited. <laughs> we're, so, uh, we're so excited and walls are absolutely shattered. I didn't actually show you, oh my god, my hair looks greasy, so I just got the shower. I didn't actually tell you guys, my bed was meant to arrive yesterday and it hasn't arrived. I called the company today and they basically said that it hasn't even left yet. So that's good. It hasn't even left the building and it's not gonna to come to the end of next week. So for now, I am sleeping on a mattress on the floor. Obviously not ideal, but it doesn't really matter. So. It really doesn't matter the grand scheme of things. It really does not matter. Mum's a little bit tipsy, by the way. Wow, you, you do months. see me. <laughs> she is, I trust me. She is. But yeah, Mum's just signing into Netflix and we are about to live life. Right, so on that note, Mum and I are gonna put on a movie. Hope you guys have enjoyed today's vlog. Obviously, there's so many more moving bits to come. Yeah, I really hope you guys will stay updated and don't forget to follow my homepage, which is Safra Barker Home. And also, my builder does actually put a lot of like behind the scenes stuff on as well. So if you wanna follow theirs, I think it's MSP Details. I'll leave it on screen anyways. But yeah, just very, very, very excited. Very happy, very grateful. Thank you to each and every one of you guys that watch my videos, because honestly, I would not be here here without all of your support and I will never ever forget that so thank you so 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 much I love you all and I shall see you soon